Test spin up to failure more than likely of the 170 millimeter EDF with the 7070 motor and 22.2 volts. And we're gonna see how far we go. Area clear. Spin up commencing. commencing. And it looks like we broke something. As expected. So let's go find out what. Okay, I got the cap off. We're gonna pull this out and get this unscrewed from the bottom. And there we are. what happened here I like how it's not there we go okay alright use the drill and get these out like our planetary gear system failed which I kind of expected and it did kind of come loose with the keyway Okay, so the motor mount's good. That looks like a tooth off of one of the gears. 
Cammy <laughs> screwdriver. Let's pry this thing up, see where it broke. Alright. Oh yeah, I can't believe I lost that tooth on that one. I'm gonna redesign these gears for sure. Yep, we lost it. Right here. As you can see. One tooth. Jammed up the whole works. Definitely time to redesign. <laughs> Just find a better gear. Set up here. Other than that, everything else is pretty stable. Just lost the one gear. Oh, there's a bearing in there. <laughs> Didn't expect that one. Okay. So we know the planetary system works, even with three gears. But. We did lose one bearing out of that and a tooth. So now you can kind of see where that one gave out. So yeah, we're gonna redo that. Other than that, and that little piece of little pieces of tooth that are right here. which we will get out of there. And then I'll just reprint the file, or reprint one of the gears. Oh, it's slipping right there too. I might have to do the planetary. Yeah, the planetary slipping. So the planetary must have also given out after the gear, the index for it anyway. So we will Pop the rest of these out. Let's see how bad it is. Oh yeah, it rounded off that index. So as you can see, it rounded off the hexagonal. See the front's hexagonal. It rounded that off, and there's another piece of tooth in there. So it was just the gears, but it was pushing some air because it knocked everything off the table up back there. So. Yeah, we're definitely gonna get back into it. Get another shaft put in there, giggity. And then uh, we'll go for it again. Probably with a smoother gear set. Since I can basically bolt this on any gear set that I want to, and I kind of just threw this one together. Uh, I'm gonna go for a different tooth pattern. Probably something not as deep on the teeth. Uh, something that'll run a little bit smoother and not have so much binding going on. So, there we are, that's the 170. The problems we've always had with it is that planetary gear system. But we'll get it, we'll get it. Motor's still good, good to go. And uh, we will definitely, definitely keep going on this one, for sure. And then of course, we can't forget this one. We cannot wait to get this one spun up again. Waiting for some pretty uh, good battery packs for that. And then we'll be good to go. My ceiling tent is up. That'll be fun. But yeah, we'll do it again. I, I knew it was going to fail. I just, it was a matter of when. And that was pretty much the whole thing. It was a matter of when this was going to fail. So, uh, well, we'll just keep going. Thanks for watching.